All right, guys, next one is going to be the double unders pass for the Bluebell curriculum. So we're going to walk ourselves up. Don't grab the belt, guys, because this moves a lot. Okay, we're going to go in right on the pants near the hips. Okay, arms in. Move the uh, knee towards the middle of the butt cheek. Start to step my leg back, and I'm going to arch my back like a cat as I keep my stiff arm. Now, guys, I'm actually doing it myself a little bit here. I don't want my uh, weight leaning over chapel like this, because then if he just moves his leg forward or pulls, my posture's broken. So when you guys get into this position, make sure that you're settled back. You have good posture. Head is now out. My head is not out in front of my hips and knees, okay? I'm going to arch my, cat like, or my back like a cat. Pop. And now, guys, I'm going to pray to get to double unders, okay? And what I mean by that is, is once his guard's open here, I don't want to try and reach through with my hands. I'm going to bring my hands together. My elbows come in, and then I lift with my elbows to get into the double unders position here. Okay, now different ways of doing this guys, um, some people like to pull them on top of the knees. I have a very difficult time doing that with people bigger than me. Okay, so I like to come in, feed my thumb in as deep as I can on this collar, come up to my feet and drive it and start to rock him up in this position. Okay, this hand's going to come to the hip, grabbing the belt or the pants so that I can get some rotation here and I'm going to slide and pressure out into position. You can go for this paper cutter right off the bat if you want. Side control. 